hello welcome back <laughs> it has been a minute since i have posted on my channel we're not gonna talk about it though um anyways but today i have gotten a package from well i bought it but anyways i got my package came from glam goth beauty glam goth beauty and we're gonna use it today i have not even opened it it is still in the fucking box um i haven't bought anything from there in a while but i love marley like that's the bad bitch right there fucking love her i've bought in I, fucking last time i bought something from there was when she was like just coming up like she only had glitters and like she had the love kill set like i still got the knife and the cigarette case and i don't know what happened to the lighter fucking brother lost the grinder so upset because she don't have those no more but i'm gonna open this and check it out because i only got the palette and then we her lipsticks Something from the store I can't get open. Nice. It's so handy and it's cute. We got baby mama right here. And then we don't need that. We got the palette. <laughs> Open this. If I can get it out. Oh, even the fucking palette is covered in plastic. It's like a fucking a book. Like, this is so cute. I fucking love it. Where's the regular shades but the fucking pans are ab the pans are huge the mirror is huge it's like a little book i feel like i'm reading a little book looking at it anyways and we shall open up the lipstick i got Nightmare, because I need a black lipstick. Oh, this is so cute. This is uh, like the fucking packaging is beautiful. Beautiful. This pretty dark. Back to the palette. I just want to swatch the lipstick really quick. What shade? I'm gonna do Daddy Vinci, which is the yellow shade because it reminds me of my hair. And this is like right over the lipstick so I just wiped it off. Okay. I'm gonna do Reaper. And it's this one right here. And these are so pretty. These are so fucking pretty. Okay. So let me go figure out what I want to do. And I'll be right back. Okay, so. First, I have to do my eyebrows. For primer, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Magic Perfecting Base. It just looks like this.
Okay, so now that I have my eyebrows somewhat drawn on, I usually wait till I'm almost done with my face before I finish the rest. So, moving on. Okay, so my camera cut off and that was really fucking disrespectful, but <clears throat> I just finished the rest of my face, I did my eyebrows, and I just have to do eyeshadow. So, like I said, the first shade that I'm going in is, is Arca Torture, which is this one, and that's gonna go on the outer corner. Just a fluffy, fluffy brush. Whatever one that you have, just use it. But like I was saying, going in with masterpiece. going back and forth in between chisel and arca torture just going in and blending and blending and blending i like wearing red um eyeshadows with these contacts because it just i feel so powerful also don't worry about if you get any fallout because Gonna be covered with eyeliner because I did figure out what I wanted to do. I seen a TikTok and I thought it was so cute. Oh, 
Okay. And then I'm gonna do kind of like the same, but on the inner corner. Okay, so for blush, I'm just I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna use this.
Okay, so getting into the palette review, I really like this palette. Like, not even just because I'm a fan, but it's really nice. The shades blend really well, if you couldn't tell from the video. But it really didn't take any effort to blend it out. Um, you can use these shades for literally anything, like contour, eyeshadow, like blush, whatever you want to use. It's in this palette. It's in there. Like, and I really like this this shade right here. If you like my skin tone or darker, Rebirth is the perfect blush. It really is, and it has sparkles in it too. So you know. Um, I'll insert swatches later, like not right now, because I just tried to swatch them, and I'm not capable of doing that on camera. I don't know why but yeah this is the final look i did use her lipstick as well this one the black nightmare very dark matte but it's not drying like i don't have the booty hole now so Anastasia prism but not shitty like the the texture I guess like it's just be very gentle you don't need a, a lot like just one and like you're good that's all you need but um if you are a makeup artist I highly recommend this because it's so uh the amount of shades that they have um anybody could use this for contour blush bronzer whatever you want you know eyeshadow but yes um those are my thoughts on this palette the lips the lipstick hold on come on out here the lipstick is really nice um very very dark very matte but not matte enough to the point where it's like comfortable and dry and gross and crumbly it looks good. But yes, those are my thoughts on the Dark Renaissance palette. You did your thing. Really nice. And it might be one of my new favorites. Especially because Rebirth. I really find I really love that shade. That shade is just because I Alright, if you guys enjoyed the video and the review and the tutorial and all the shit that I had going on in it then please subscribe comment down below what you think hit the like button you know do what you do I know it's been a minute since I've uploaded a tutorial and I have like zero videos on my account except for the vlog that I uploaded I didn't like those videos so I deleted them but yeah if you want to see more then subscribe like and comment Bye.